हेलो गाइज दिस इज रेवन फ्रॉम डिजी इंटीग्रेटिव वेलकम टू टेक्न्यूज एपिसोड 33. Realme is going to launch its Realme 8 and Realme 8 Pro on March 24th at 7:30 p.m. Before its launch a pre-book sale has been started for Realme 8 and 8 Pro and Infinity sale has been started on Flipkart from 15th of March to 22nd of March where you can block your Realme 8 and Realme 8 Pro and you get a Realme earbuds Neo Bluetooth headset true wireless speaker for just 1499 and you are getting a 50% offer of this bluetooth headset Realme X9 Pro concrete edition leaks in live photos over the weekend we saw a tina listing for an upcoming Realme devices bearing the RMX 3116 model number the device speculated as Realme X9 Pro or GT Neo packs a curved 6.55 inch display and a dual cell 4400 mAh battery According to the previous speculation the phone will also launch with Dimensity 1200 chipset. Poco X3 is set to launch in India on March 30th. Poco X3 Pro price in India could be similar to Poco F1 at around rupees 21000 rupees. This handset will come as a successor to Poco X3. Poco X3 Pro specifications may include Snapdragon 860, 120 Hz full HD plus display and a 5200 mAh battery. Poco has finally taken its wrap of the secret that has been roaming on the internet. The company has set March 22nd as the launch date for the global markets as it is expected to be Poco X3 Pro and Poco F3 or Poco F3 Pro. Poco Global in an official tweet said that this event is going to be a biggest launch of Poco for the year 2021 with the tagline when power meets speed. Motorola teases the arrival of G100 smartphone showing the device design in blue color. The company has finally said it to bring the global markets on March 25th. Moto G100 will likely to feature 6.7 inch full HD plus IPS LCD display with a 90 Hz refresh rate. This display will have a dual punch hole on it and it comes with 16 megapixel and a 8 megapixel front camera with 20 is to 9 aspect ratio. And this mobile also spot with Snapdragon 870 chipset and the camera will be around 64 megapixel and a 64 megapixel of wide angle camera and a 16 megapixel of ultra wide angle camera 2 megapixel of depth sensor camera OnePlus is coming up with the good news CEO Pat Liu announced that OnePlus 9 series will come with 2 year warranty instead of industry standard 1 year Some regions like European Union already have 2 years of warranty for all electronic products but most of the world doesn't have The company looked at surveys and found that flagship buyers keep their phone for around 2 years before upgrading. This move will give buyers a peace of mind that any hardware defects will be handled without any extra cost. Micromax is gearing up for a launch on new smartphone in the country. Indian company had made a comeback to the smartphone market in November last year with an in series. The upcoming phone dubbed as in one will go officially on March 19th. According to the new leak Micromax in one will come with a 6.67 inch display with a punch hole cutout and a full HD plus resolution. For performance the phone will reportedly feature MediaTek Helio G80 processor. The phone will also come with 6GB of RAM and up to 128GB storage. It comes with 5000mAh battery and a 18W fast charger within the box. HMD Global has started a teaser of upcoming smartphones which will be a launch on April 8th. This event will introduce new Nokia smartphones for this year. The company also mentioned a hashtag Love Trust Keep along with the date, time and the man looking at the pine trees without giving any hints of what to expect. An upcoming Google Pixel device was listed on Indian BIS website. The Google Pixel 5a is expected to launch in India soon. Google Pixel 5a design was recently revealed. This new Google phone with code name Jerome 2 is mostly like the upcoming Google Pixel 5a which will supposedly arrive in June. Automobile portal Cardeco on Monday launched an advanced and compact GPS vehicle tracking system uplink to gain real-time access to a host of information such as live tracking, rash driving alerts, trip history and among others. Powered by compact plug and play device that can be connected to any vehicle Uplink provides around the clock safety security and surveillance of the vehicle. Amazon and Flipkart may have a new headache as Indian e-commerce policy could also question their algorithm. Recent leaks from the draft e-commerce policy spell more trouble for the likes of Amazon and Flipkart. E-commerce firms in India will have to ensure that 
all sellers on the platform are treated equally and should not use algorithms to give partial treatment to any seller recently amazon business had come under speculation for preferential treatment towards seller that it had stake in cloudtel and apario indian government is in the final stages of formulating its draft e-commerce policy and recent leaks from the draft spell more trouble for the likes of amazon and flipkart thanks for watching this video please kindly support my channel by giving a like share and subscribe and follow digi integrity on twitter instagram and facebook